fly with my family and I to Egypt. Well, just for context, this video was in me. It's not a recent trip. Yes, but just come along with us. <laughs> yeah, we had boarded and we were about to take off. This was my seat partner, my mom. They gave us this um, warm towel to clean our hands, just to sanitize and be clean. Then we were served our lunch. Egypt Air, not the best airline, but yeah, we landed Egypt, Cairo. The flight was for about six hours, but it was a short one. This is like a mini room tour. We stayed in Holiday Inn. That's the name of the hotel in Cairo. Um, it's two rooms, two suites connecting to each other because we're a family of eight and we needed to stay close to each other. So we requested that they give us like rooms that were very close. Yes, this one room, um, my mom, myself and Boo Boo stayed in the room and also my mom's assistant. While the other room, my sister's stayed, like they shared that particular room. They had a kitchen, which we really wished we had come with like noodles or something so we could prepare because we're not so used to their food. But this was the next day. We came down for breakfast. It's like a buffet thing, had lots of options, options that we're also not very familiar with. So we just stuck to something we could eat. Yeah, they had like sweet, 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 sweet things, especially. But this was what I selected for our first day. I'm such a hot chocolate lover. And I actually made this video of Boo Boo. She told me to make a cute video of her, but I ended up doing this one. Uh, yes, this trip was also for my mom's birthday. She turned 50 and we're so happy. We're singing happy birthday song to her. This particular day was her birthday. She was dancing. I mean, why won't she dance like David? Because it's not easy. It's not everyone that gets to see 50. But right after that, we changed and we started to go out for our first activity for the day. But the girl was sleeping at this point and I obviously had to make a video. So this was us at the Great Pyramid of Egypt. We went to see the pyramid. We didn't stay long here because it was like a long walk. We don't know why we'll be stressing ourselves while on vacation. But we left, like we stayed for just a few minutes and we left. While on our way, we saw this statue of Pharaoh and I made a video of it. We're just going to our next place because we had different places to go to. This was the gold um, store. They had lots of things like ornaments, valuable things for sale. Had gold. My mom wanted to get like original gold. And because this was this was the only place that we knew that they were certified. They had license to sell like original gold. Uh, right after that, we went to the mall where my sister selected like baby wears. Then later in the evening, we went for my mom's birthday dinner that was planned out by our travel agent, Skies and Seas. It was such a cute day. And just on a, just for context again, it was really cold during the period we traveled. And I got this jacket while in Egypt. I got it from Zara. Most of my outfit, all my, all my outfit was from Zara. And this was where we did the dinner on a boat. It was such a sweet event. Yeah, everything was planned by the travel agent. She made the surprise for my mom. And she, my mom was very happy because this was one of her dreams to like celebrate with her family on a boat and also be handed flowers. See how happy she was because this was her first time getting her flowers. She was so, so happy. Like it gave us great joy to see her smile like this. And we're also grateful to God for keeping our life to see her 50th birthday. Like I said, it's not every day you get to see your 50th. This is my sister and our little cake from Skies and Seas as well. I made a video of myself because I looked cute. I really loved how I look and went to rest. Yeah, the next day we boarded another flight to our next location still in Egypt. We were leaving Cairo and my seat partner for this one was my sister, China no we cheers to long life and to our mom's 50th birthday. This was me sipping my apple juice because I'm not a lover of alcohol. 
But yeah, we had landed our destination. This was our final destination in Egypt. We had left Cairo and they called this place Sham El Sheikh. I don't know if I pronounced it correctly, but that's what I call it. It's such a beautiful city. So, so beautiful. This particular city is like, it was, I think it's made for tourism, basically, for tourists to come and enjoy Egypt. That's what the city is for. So this was the first hotel we stayed at in Sham El Sheikh. Um, it's called White Hills Resort. This hotel is so beautiful. I think they just stuck with the white color theme. That was like the theme of the hotel. They're giving like Bali vibes in Egypt. And this is a mini room tour. It's their suite. Their suite was quite small, if I'm being honest, because like I said, we a large number of family that traveled together and we took um two suites and we had to also take a basic room. We actually upgraded the suite while at the resort. But yeah, we settled in, came out for dinner and this was where we had dinner. Lovely, lovely space. And this is the hotel at night. Ah, this hotel was so fine, like extremely beautiful. <laughs> you guys, IJ is outside creating content and we can't even open the door. Basically the glass. Because she won't let us. So I'm stuck here. Why she's creating content and we have to go for breakfast. Look. Yes, yeah, so our content lady finally let us out of the room. And this was just me on my way to the restaurant where we'd be having breakfast. And this was what I picked for breakfast. I was just picking different things because I wasn't sure what I would like. But we all just picked different things so that... We, um, if we don't like this first option we'll pick, we can at least eat the second one. But right after breakfast, we went back to our rooms, changed into our swimwear and went to the beach. We stayed here for a while. The beach was so fine. Like, it was so, so fine. And we decided to walk to the um, where the water was. <laughs> Guys, I can't swim, so I ran from the beach. And I went back to the pool right in front of our rooms. Yeah, this was me in the pool, just having fun, laughing, and my sister was here too. Boo Boo wanted to join us in the pool, but it was too deep for her. You would hear her voice at some point in the video. I included that part of the video as well. In the water! I'm having fun here. Then yeah, let me give you a kiss. <laughs> yeah, when we were done swimming, we changed and we went to this place. I don't know what this place is, but it was quite scary. I don't like cats and they had lots of cats. But we didn't stay here for long. The Nigerian in us didn't like this place. We felt like it was giving Habalist vibe. But I don't know. We just didn't like this place. We left here and we went to get sugar and cane and that was it for the day. So this was a new day. I went out for breakfast. Right after breakfast, I went to the beach to take pictures because I couldn't get pictures from the previous day. I went there. I went here alone because my family wanted to rest. Most of them wanted to just sleep right after we had breakfast. But I came here. I sat down for a while and then it was lunch time. Had lunch. Then went back to the room to change because we had another activity mapped out. This was me and my sister in the golf cart. Um, we're driving to a new location. This was where we went to. We came to the des um, desert. Guys, I drove this thing for long. Like it was quite scary but fun at the same time. I drove my sister and I, um, my sister Chinanu. I drove both of us together at the desert. Then. We got to a stop and we rode the camel. It was to go first on the camel. She was scared though. She didn't want to go first, but I don't know anywhere we go to. They always like to, they always like able to, be to go first in most of the activities. Guys, I'm about to hit. 
family rode on the camel aside my sister that was pregnant she couldn't join us so she was um, seated at the space and when we do we came to this place i don't know what to call this place but i don't know why this people hey, think that it's okay to play with snakes like we just couldn't stand it we don't take such risks in our country we don't so i don't know how they um, communicate with these snakes but we're not having it we just wanted to go at that point in time and they asked some um tourists to volunteer and these people had the mind to come out because they wanted to carry snake that could never be us the nigerian in us would never allow that but yeah whatever rocks their boots they liked it and they did it and they, i guess they had fun you could actually tell from their expressions that they had fun doing it but we we didn't like it at all we just came there to eat because we're tired of the whole thing the ride and everything right after that we drove back again i rode this um quad bike back to where our car was and we called it a night but when we got to the hotel i started to make another video just to show you guys the view of this hotel like i said it's so beautiful and that was it for that day the next day was just rest day we didn't plan anything so i decided to use the opportunity to create content for that day i changed into different act um, attires different ways and i took pictures made videos that i was going to post on my socials that's my facebook my instagram my tiktok my youtube i made a lot of videos so it's me in like the third or before to attire i didn't get all of it but that was it then the next day was the water day we entered a boat it was like a boat cruise guys i regretted this activity with so much passion the ride was too long and we had seasickness almost all of us this was we had to stay under the sun because it was also cold so we're just tired from the um sailing it was such a long long drive like it was so long we're so tired but at the end we finally did what we came there to do which was scuba diving this was for somebody that cannot swim i was scared though i was smiling but i was terrified the people that could swim were already in the sea and i changed they gave me this thing to the oxygen mask that i had on my back and i went into the water you guys just hear when they threw me into the water to be honest it took a lot of convincing for me to do this which i ended up loving because i felt like oh i had too much sick sickness to not end up doing what i wanted to do but this was me in the sea acting like a superwoman i had so much fun yeah that was me right after diving so we saw dolphins we had to make videos i was not even having it at this point i just wanted to go back to the hotel and when we got to the hotel went for dinner this sweet gentleman gave me flowers and that was it for that night they gave all of us though that was it so the next day we were already 
packed our bags because we're going to the next hotel but before then we had breakfast and i created content with my mom that was it for white hills and the next one was rigsos golf villa and sweet and honestly we traveled with so much boxes like we traveled with a lot this hotel is so beautiful we actually saved the best for the last this is just part of the hotel like they had the villa aspect and the normal rooms we're on our way to our villa which was upgraded for us for free was given to us for free guys like this was such a beautiful stay look at where we're going to stay yeah. it was so so fine like we loved this place yeah, so we're much always going to guys this is our villa <laughs> Can I have to keep this? Yes, yeah, sure. Thank you. You're welcome. Welcome to your second home. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So yeah, this is like a mini tour of our villa. You, this place was so so beautiful the ambience was good family friendly like for a large family like us it was the perfect place for us but while doing the tour i just want to tell you guys that you see in this life just ask like the bible says ask and it shall be given unto you i just decided to something in me told me to walk up to the lady and tell her that it was my mom's birthday and if it was possible for us to get the villa we had seen it on the sites that it was really expensive that i wouldn't really mind to like um tag them since i'm an influencer i create a content for them and everything but i didn't even have to say much all i did was mention that like, my mom's birthday and they upgraded you the guys, we are literally like in the best hotel ever it's a villa actually it has five rooms five rooms the whole farm is like <laughs> So this is my own room. And this is Jesse the baby's room. Did you knock? Did you knock the whole entry? Should I know soon? Did you knock? This is another bathroom. Bathroom. And this is room. There's room downstairs. Yes. No, in case you will leave you, Jojo. Will. This is another room with a bath, bathroom too. Oh my goodness! This is another room, you guys. Oh my god, I'm so happy! Look, let me tell you guys. See, there's so much power in the tongue. I tell you for sure because this room. This villa is actually coming to us for free. I just walked up to the receptionist and I'm like, okay, it's my mom's birthday the, this month, obviously. And we would like to upgrade our rooms. Because it was supposed to be like a standard room. And she was just like, okay, I'll try and see if there's anything I can do. And boom, they upgraded us to the villa for free. Ah, I'm so happy. See here. Can I call you Rose? I do we'll do that our content here. The one of oh my god, look at the pool. Cool is it? Like, you have a yes. Oh my god. I swear, Jay. And Bubu can swim here. This thing will not react to my body. No, this no, no. Is not blue. No. This one is clean water. This was a be a few hours after swimming. The other hotels we stayed in, the pool were too deep for her. So this one was so perfect. So she went to swim. Immediately we got in and later on she was tired that she dozed off. Look at Boss Baby. Look at the real Boss Baby. But yes, later in the evening, we changed and we went for dinner. I said everything in this hotel was perfect. They planned out a dinner for us and we didn't have to pay. It was like not this fancy restaurant, like fine dining. We had dinner at the um, Turkish restaurant. And this was the first place we had dinner at. Um, it was a Turkish restaurant. Their food was amazing. It was so good. We all looked pretty, dolled up. And <laughs> the starters were funny, but... 
I didn't make a video of the main dish. The next day was one of the best days for me. It was fun and very interesting. I did most of the activities I loved so much. We started off by parasailing. It was so interesting. I thought I would be nervous. Yes, I was initially. I thought I, would, well, I thought I was going to be very, very scared. But it turned out that I had so much fun, like extremely. This was us. I went with my mom's assistant, NK. We team on the swan and we enjoyed it so, so much. I would definitely do this over and over again. And the speed, <laughs> the speed was a lot, but it was very, very fun. They um, told us to pose for pictures. They took pictures of us and these people took us, they like, they pushed us into the water. It was so cold. That was us screaming like we had so much fun we didn't even want it to stop but the next people to go was boo boo and chinanu um they weren't having it the next one was this banana ride guys this was another fun activity look at us smiling like it was such an interesting ride Right after the banana ride, we went on this floating chair thing. Guys, this one was extremely scary, but at the same time, it was fun for me. I was just scared that my wig was going to uh, fall off. But look at this. The speed of this thing. Hmm. We're hanging on to our dear lives, but guys, I had when I said I loved it so much. This was actually my best activity for the day. Yes, I can't, I can't really say if this was my best or the parasailing, but it was either one of them. No coming down. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's go. No. Give me your hand. Give me hand. Guys, can you believe that right after all those activities, we got back to our hotel, we changed into another swimwear, and we came to the general pool. Like, we just wanted to have fun. That was it for us. This trip was actually fun. Like, it was so fun. And I just was very glad that we could bond together because we are all growing. Everybody is so busy. It's good to just find um, time to spend with family because the more we grow, the more we are a bit distant. And I just love the fact that we could do this. Like, it was very, very good. Then later, we went out for dinner, went, for, went to the Italian restaurant, and we had pizza and some other foods. After eating, we came out and they had this um, act dancing thing going on, entertainment thing going on. These people just planned themselves very well. But that was it for the night. The next day, we came out for breakfast, had breakfast, and we hot chocolate girly every day, all day. I'll always have hot chocolate. After we had breakfast, we went to see their spa. Um, they had this sweet spa. Uh, we started to do a massage there we came to check it out first then we booked a session myself my sisters and my mom we all came for the massage that was so good as well this was my own room this was where they would give me the massage and it was such a beautiful massage i slept all through and the lady's hand was soft but after that i went back to the um, room changed into this wear because we're going to their golf area the golf place and i wanted to take pictures i changed into the square because i just wanted to take pictures i took pictures in the golf cart took pictures in the garden as well i don't know what they call this place Shab, but i just took pictures everywhere i looked good and i just made videos um, my, my sister too took pictures boo boo took pictures different places in the hotel because like every spot in this hotel is picture friendly this was me making a video and after that i changed into this shirt because we we're going for dinner and this was our last night in the hotel before we we're going to go back to nigeria it was a fun stay 
we had Chinese for that day. We had Chinese um, for dinner and it wasn't the best, not to lie. <laughs> that was my sister complaining that she didn't want the trip to end but we had to go back home and yes we got back to nigeria and i got home to a surprise guys i couldn't get all the activities i just compiled the few videos i have so yeah thank you so much for watching love you so much